If your laptop is struggling to edit videos that are recorded in 1080p, 4K or 8K, then this video solves your problem. In this video, I'm sharing how to create proxies in Premiere Pro software in under 2 minutes. Let's start. First, open the Premiere Pro software and import all the footage. You can do this process either after adding footage to the timeline or before that. Both ways, it works. Select the clip that you want to create the proxies and click the right button on the mouse. You get one option menu here. In that, select the proxies option, then create proxies. After selecting that, one more window pops like this. Now here, you need to make some changes. First, select the frame size. You can choose either full, half, quarter or custom. If you click the custom, you can change the width and height of the video. I'm selecting half for this tutorial. After selecting the preset, here you get a lot of options. I suggest choosing the ProRes QuickTime Proxy. It gives good quality when compared to others. The below option is a watermark. You can enable it or disable it. Also, you can select the custom image as well. The last option is location. I usually click next to the original media in the proxy folder. So I don't need to worry about where these files are saved. You can choose the custom path as well if in case you want. Now click on OK. The media encoder is opened after this and starts processing. If the media encoder is not available in your system, then this won't work. Also during this process, you can do editing. There is no problem with that. After completion of the process, in the program tab, you can see the icon called toggle proxies. Enable it. If in case you are unable to see this, click on this plus icon from here and now you can drag and drop the proxies option. That's all. This is how you can create proxies for a video file in Adobe Premiere Pro. If you want to know the best YouTube video exporting settings from Premiere Pro, I highly recommend you to watch this video. Spoiler alert, I use these options only.